got back there in that cattle pot? Gold digger. All right. So what you running there today? You got a four and a quarter air to air cat in it. Fifteen over. We're all sitting over there at the old uh, four states chrome shop mafia, and I saw you pull in and I'll tell you what, that truck is a head turner. Yeah, uh, it's different. You don't see too many gold ones. You know, it kind of stands out from the crowd. What year is it? 87. How do you get down the road without people uh, wanting to talk to you about it? Just get it and go. Get it and go. For those that are not mechanically inclined, you said air to air. Explain what that is. The air to air charger on it. Some of them didn't have the mechanical motors. Some of them do. This is one of them. Now you said uh, an air charger. What does that do for the engine? Gives it more juice through the turbo, makes it draw more. We're up here, uh, it's a week of the Super Rigs, the 2016 Super Rigs truck show. Uh, is this a truck that you're going to put there in the show, or uh, what are you going to do there? Yeah, I'm going to show it over there, the classic division. I think it definitely fits the bill. Uh, obviously, you're hooked to a cattle pot there. What do you do with the truck? Well, cattle, six days a week. Runs all the time, never stops. Now tell me something, uh, how'd you come about this truck? How'd you get your hands on it? I knew the truck for a while and uh, I had that other one. You know, I just wanted to do some trading on this one and that other one. That's how I ended up with it. I run it every day since then. 10-4, and well, what, are the th what are some of the things that you really love about this truck here? Uh, 359, I was looking for a nice one for a long time. It's hard to find what I want one. That's what I started with when I was younger, I bought my first one when I was 16 years old, drove it around a little bit, and I kind of knew what I said, like I started, what I wanted to stay with. So how in the world you get to where you're buying trucks at 16? Just moving cattle with it, my own stuff. Roger that. So that's, uh, is that something you grew up in uh, family-wise doing that? Yeah, kind of one of them deals, you inherit the business, you know, you've been around it all your life, too late to quit now. I hear that. So how many years have you been driving for then? About 25. Well, a lot of people love a good looking cattle truck and uh, they appreciate people moving cattle and whatnot. I'm going to throw a question at you. Uh, a lot of people uh, here, here of late, they'd want to protest moving animals and whatnot and all this stuff want to block people from getting to their delivery points. What's your take on all that stuff? I'd say to grow up and deal with reality. We haul a lot of killer cows, stuff like McDonald's, all that. You know, out of central Missouri here, we go to Nebraska, Wyoming, a lot of dairy cattle, South Texas, there, New Mexico. But you got to feed the world, you know, the way I look at it. Yeah, you're right about that, and some people, uh, they, see, they just don't see it that way. Well, thanks for weighing in on that. We're going to cruise back here to the Super Rig show. And more, sound like a plan.
righty, Travis. Well, we're going to see you uh, in a little bit once you get all uh, situated here. You have, a, have yourself a good show. Uh, yeah, i got to figure out where I need to go here. Ten bar.